You know, it's something we all own, especially women. Hair care products help us look our best, which is why some people are willing to shell out major bucks. But are you getting what you pay for? ABC 2 News consumer reporter Mallory Safaste has a warning on a line of popular hair products that may be different than what's advertised. And because if it matters to you, it's a matter for Mallory. It's known as the dirty little secret in the salon industry. Diversion is the unauthorized sale of professional products to a third party um, or a wholesaler. Paul Mitchell calls it a backdoor deal. Paul Mitchell has contracts with distributors. Those distributors sell to the salons. But somewhere along the way, the products are ending up in the hands of wholesalers. And then you see it end up at our CVS, our Target. The problem isn't necessarily the backdoor deal. It's what happens to the product once it's been diverted. Paul Mitchell only guarantees their products purchased from a professional beauty salon, not from a drugstore, supermarket, or unauthorized source. And throughout the years, Paul Mitchell has been tracking what happens to diverted products. They've found bacteria. They've found just the product separation in there. Uh, it could be a totally different product. We went and bought two of the same products, one from the salon, the other from CVS, a block away from the salon. The bottles look the same except for the tops, and we checked the batch coats. The one from CVS is one year old, the one from the salon just a few months old. And the product inside looked slightly different but smelled the same, so the major difference was the price. The one at the salon cost $11.50. The one at CVS cost $14. So not only are you getting a diverted product as far as what it's made of, but you're spending a few more dollars. Rosalind Holsey owns Studio 7, the salon and spa. She said diverted products takes money away from local salons and consumers are paying more for potentially inferior product. I would not ever suggest buying a product from a chain store or a grocery store. You just you're not safe. You just don't know where that product came from. Or how it's stored. Temperatures can affect the ingredients. Some sellers have even been known to top off bottles with different products in order to make them look more full. Bottom line, stylists want to make sure their clients have the same great experience at home as they did in the salon. It smells amazing. In Baltimore, Mallory Safaste, ABC2 News. Mallory also found a three-year-old product for sale at that CVS. And according to John Paul Mitchell Systems, that's when their products start to break down. We reached out to CVS and they said all hair care products we offer for sale are purchased and are being sold lawfully under all applicable laws. Now, these are genuine products in good and sellable condition. And they also offer a 100% money-back refund on beauty products for any reason.